Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. When you subscribe we will use the information you provide to send you these newsletters. Sometimes they'll include recommendations for other related newsletters or services we offer. R explains more about how we use your data, and your rights. You can unsubscribe at any time. Stars Andy Robertson and were slammed by Roy Keane at half-time of today's loss to Liverpool were trailing at the break thanks to a late goal from midfielder Mario Lemina. Robertson failed to clear a free kick and Salah lost possession on the edge of his box, before Lemina fired in a fine shot past Reds goalkeeper Alice Son. Liverpool were already on a run of five consecutive defeats at Anfield for the first time in their history. Speaking on Sky Sports at half-time, Keane said Fulham were deservedly in front on Merseyside. But the Irishman was not impressed with Robertson and Salah's part in the goal. Well it's a lovely technique, shocking from Liverpool's point of view, Keane said. Set, piece obviously, I think Robertson's got to do better. Salah, ok it's not one of his strengths, outmuscled. But lovely technique the way he gets across the ball and they deserve it. Not a great delivery, I think Robertson's got to do better, Salah's got to be stronger, he cannot lose it there. Fantastic strike but it's amazing what's happened to this Liverpool team, a shadow of themselves. Comment, quotes, opinion, Salah, not good enough, not strong enough. Desire. But Robertson's got to do better as well, he's got to get a better header away. Liverpool boss Jurgen Klopp made seven changes to his team following the 1,0 defeat to Chelsea on Thursday. Ahead of the match, Keane claimed it was clear there was a lack of happiness amongst the Reds squad. He's obviously, I think, lost patience with some of the players, Keane said. I think obviously we keep analysing how it is defensively, but going forward, the lack of goals particularly at home, even during the week we said Terry's ways to lose a game of football. I don't think they're a happy group. I look at players who were taken off, and I obviously don't expect a player to be happy to be taken off, but shaking their head, sitting in the stand, not great body language. We saw it again with Salah during the week, we saw it with, Sadio, main down at Palace, with, James, Milner at West Ham. I don't think they're a happy group and I think to make that many changes, ok there are a couple of changes and there are games coming up, but I think he's thought, enough is enough. 